What's up, Chosen Ones, man? I'm back with another video. Name of this video is going to be called Chosen Ones. They love to watch you, but will never admit it. They will never admit that they love to watch you. They love to watch you, man. Like, like, and even though you see yourself as a regular human, you see yourself as someone who my life is not like that's important, but it's not like something you have to watch. You know what I'm saying? I'm not like Nick Cannon and like I'm not like in a movie, like 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 you think you have to systematically watch me and address me and clock me and mention me and even on the phone talk about mention su subjects that you feel like can include me or perspectives and so they were never admitted stalking watching but they really don't even like you like that. But they stalk and they watch you. And they, they, they disguise the hate with the love. Disguise the hate with the love. They are mega Decepticons. That's what they are. Decepticons. In this state. In this world, they are mega Decepticons. <laughs> and they love, they enjoy so much being able to get away with your lack thereof. So if you don't got money, then they love that. They love that. Because you're becoming the Ken Barbie doll. You, you, you're like a Barbie doll. I can control him. Oh, my God. God or whoever, Satan, has blessed me with someone I could control of this stature. Oh, man, I'm about to have me a good old time, man. I got me some uh, guaranteed lifetime friend. I don't know when I'm going to pass away, but I know I could bother this mug. I could get me some entertainment throughout my day, man. I could, you know, I could, I, this is, this is delicious. So they love bomb you. They love bomb you. And there's many ways to love bomb somebody, especially with through money, through money and, and gifts and financial. It all begins there. It, begun, it begins and ends with finances, money. A certificate in and out of your life. Then they pick, uh, then they pick apart after they love bomb you, they pick you apart. After I buy you some food, I'm going to get on the phone around you and talk loud to see if you address me. Because I just paid for your food. You're a slave right now. Your own parents. Your own parents. You would think that they weren't such a snake. But they're showing you in your face. In your face. Because it's, it's, more, it's better served in your face. They want to make a mockery out of you. With the one-two combo. The love bomb and then the pick apart. 
Because when you're fasting and you're not eating their food, it's a given that the system will not thrive at all. And they can't get away with nothing. Because the light, the light upsets the darkness all the time. The light, the light upsets the despair. The abyss. The light, the light violates the abyss all the time. The light is very more per pervasive than the darkness. The darkness is weak. The darkness is just there when the light is off. So my channel is about enlightenment. Enlightened. The enlightened, chosen, selected. But listen here. It's all a game. We don't allow people to shift our moods, chosen ones. Even though we know that that's exactly what they're trying to do. We're here to master not having our moods shifted. Like I said, no matter if it's supernatural or, or they're using genetically engineered modified foods or whatever, whatever they doing, bro, it's still our light that's going to break the curse because energy is everything chosen one so if you don't got no money you can't feed yourself so you gotta starve or fast and those two things seem like the same thing so what you'll hear time all the time is when you fast the narco come out the out, out of the abyss and they'll say oh are you hungry did you eat today because they're like, I can't really, can all you should hear when they say that is, I can't really control you today unless you eat some of my food, my porridge, my poison porridge, eat from my poison porridge. And that's what it is, man. Poison porridge. I don't care what it is. It's poison porridge. These people are Decepticons because, like I said, the genetically engineered modified food is what makes you sensitive and which makes them able to annoy you. And if they can annoy you, they can move you. And if they can move you, then you're you're like a loose tooth. You're no longer sturdy in the game. You're no longer sturdy in the game because they systematically out, out, outfoxed you. You let a old hag out shift you out of your growth and development. And that's why I always talk about the levels of codependency and the expectations you should have of oneself. You can very much so know these expectations and still go in the kitchen and grab from their food. Because what? Because out of habit. And so the narcissists know that every day this fool plucks plucks some starburst out of my out of my thing and and, and, and uh devours one I'm gonna devour him in the game but I'm a I'm a I'm a see the thing that make these people annoying is they do it right in your face they do it right in your face so I'm gonna go ahead and end this video man and last but not least man God's will God will do it all. We don't have to do nothing, man. I'm going to see you on the next video, man. I'm out.